So Chris Chan is out of jail and Sonic the Hedgehog is dead. Is this a coincidence or not? We're gonna we're gonna talk about we're gonna talk mostly about Sonic the Hedgehog being dead. Sega has decided they're gonna kill off Sonic the Hedgehog. But yes, Chris Chan is also uh, out of jail. Apparently, we'll we'll talk more about that. Let's let's talk about Sonic the Hedgehog getting killed. This is uh, an actual game. Uh, <laughs> Sega has killed off Sonic the Hedgehog. They have a game out there called literally the murder of Sonic the Hedgehog. People are saying it's not canonical. Sega's saying it's not canonical. So don't worry, furries. Sonic the Hedgehog is fine. Um, but I think it's hilarious that they killed him off on uh, April Fool's. So we're going to talk about this. We're going to talk about some of the reactions to it. I thought it was a joke joke, but uh, it was not a joke. Was, uh, this is a real game. Sonic the Hedgehog is dead. And also Chris Chan is, is apparently out on bail. So let's talk about this before we get into it any further. Please subscribe for more pop culture news, views, and rants. Guys, uh, over 300,000, I think. Over 300,000. I am going to wait and see because sometimes YouTube uh, does pull some shenanigans. Things go up and down. Could have been April Fool's joke. They could have been like, yeah, yeah, you guys have 300. Now you don't. No, I'm just kidding. Totally kidding, guys. Uh, so we're going to wait a few days. We're going to wait a while and make sure that we're actually over 300. But uh, thank you so much for the support. Um, we're going to talk about Sonic the Hedgehog. Uh, go out to the gaming channel. Sometimes we play Sonic the Hedgehog on the gaming channel, Clownfish Gaming. Uh, yeah, so this was uh, tweeted yesterday. Right before April Fool's, Sega retweeted, the Sonic social team proudly presents The Murder of Sonic the Hedgehog, a brand new Sonic game available right now on Steam for free. Let's, let's check this out. We've heard your feedback. Yes, all of it. That's my movie voice, right? We now have a bold new direction for the future of Sonic. Cool. We're excited to announce. He's dead. Sonic, somebody murdered my darling Sonic. Oh my God, that's hilarious. Solve the mystery behind Sonic's murder. Oh my God, nope. Knuckles did it, Knuckles totally did it. And Sonic killed himself. Uh, so there we go, guys. This is, I mean, it looks kind of low effort, but um, it looks like a lot of fun. I might have to pick this up. I might actually have to pick this up. This actually looks pretty good. Oh, my God. Tails did it. Tails did it. Yeah, it's it's for free on Steam, guys. You can go pick it up right now. I might have to play. I might have to play this. So here is the story on uh, GameSpot. You know, GameSpot, they laid a bunch of people off, right? So they still have enough people to write for them, I guess. Sega killed Sonic as an April Fool's treat. Sonic's dead, according to Sega's new release, The Murder of Sonic the Hedgehog. The game is an April Fool's gift, and The Murder of Sonic the Hedgehog is free on Steam. The game takes a visual novel format and opens with Sonic dying on the Mirage Express during Amy Rose's murder mystery party held to celebrate her birthday. Yeah, she killed him. She totally did bitch it's up to you the player to find out who killed sonic and what sinister things are afoot as for whether this game is canonical the answer is no this is not a sonic team title but we strongly of course not of course wouldn't that be funny if it was this is not a sonic team title but we strongly believe in the power of head cannon oh don't don't say that don't say that we're getting to chris chan sonic frontiers is the most recent canon sonic game an open world game released on november 8th which i have and i haven't played yet i literally i got it for christmas and it is like so many other games i have in the shrink wrap and i haven't played it but everybody says it's really good but i, I haven't had a chance to play it yet um but uh, yeah, so this is pretty funny stuff, man. I think it's hilarious that they would kill Sonic off on April Fool's. I wish it was canon. I wish it was canon just to see people scream. That would be amazing. Like, yeah, guys, Sonic's dead. We're never making another Sonic game. Um, Sonic is completely dead. But um, yeah, I mean, it looks it looks you know like a visual novel. Uh, you know, lots of static images, but it's okay. It's all right. It's free, right? So you gonna complain? It's a free Sonic game. Um, so anyway, let's talk about Chris Chan because, yeah, Chris Chan Chris Chan was released on Bond. And uh, this is coming from what? Uh, Sports Kita. Sports Kita. Uh, their hilarious reactions as the mugshot goes viral. Netizens were shocked after news of YouTuber Christine Weston Chandler, a.k.a. Chris Chan, being released on jail Monday went viral. Uh, the Sonichu creator, also known by her, her, 
thought I thought he, I thought he they them said that they were a he mostly, but okay. Uh, also known by her online moniker, uh, unpronounceable, was arrested on charges of incest on who. August 1st, 2021. This is after an alleged phone conversation leaked online, uh, suggested she had intimate relations with her mother who suffers from dementia. Yes, we know the, um, we know the story. Is Chris Chan in the game? Did Chris Chan kill Sonic? A screenshot of Chris Chan's record from the Central Virginia Region Jail has been doing the rounds on Twitter stating she's out of custody soon. Post about a man named Samson Jekyll paying for her bond or scene with the exact bail amount in Jekyll's Intentions remain unclear. However, the news remains unverified at the time of writing this article. Uh, as news of the webcomic creator's release spread, several internet users expressed their shock on social media. The Christology continues. Netizens horrified after news of Chris Chan's release spread. Oh my God. Chris Chan has been released from prison. Uh, who was the heathen responsible for paying Chris Chan's bond? I want to talk. Maybe it was Sega. Chris Chan getting out of prison. The end times are nigh. Yes. And Sonic is dead. I'm just saying. Me finding out Chris Chan has been released from jail on bond. Yeah, it's... Uh, maybe it's a coincidence. I don't know. I hope it is. I hope it is. I don't know, guys. Mostly I wanted to talk about Sonic. I just I just think it's hilarious that they would actually kill Sonic the Hedgehog for April Fool's. Uh, it is a free game. Go out. Check it out. Um... And that's it. That's that's the video. That's the video. There's not much going on this weekend. Probably do a follow up on D&D. Apparently it's doing better than predicted, projected. Um, and people look, people said the movie's actually pretty good. They said the movie's actually pretty good. What was going to hurt it is the lack of buzz. Not a lot of people knew the movie was coming out. And the fact that the D&D brand is kind of in the gutter right now because of Watsy getting greedy. But um, other than that, uh, yeah, we'll see what's, we'll see what's going on. Enjoy April Fool's. Uh, we're not going to do any joke videos cause I think they're dumb. Um, talk to you later. Help support the channel. Go to the reef dot support and get early access to podcasts, videos, and other content. That's the reef dot support.